Hello guys, our today's topic is multiple selection search help in MDG. So you can see this is like continuation of my previous video which I have done long back about a year ago OVS search helps in MDG. So in this part I have covered mostly all of that but only thing I missed in this is multiple search helps I, ha I haven't covered it. So few people have commented in the video to explain about multiple search helps and how to implement that. So let's go into the video. Now I have done exactly same in my system. So until this point it is fine. Now what else extra I have to do I will explain that. So let's go to the system. Currently my requirement is like this. So if I click on search help, search terms, because of that simple obvious search help, after clicking on go, it is showing these three values. Now if I click on any one of them, this particular uh, short value will get updated in search terms field. So let's see this. I am clicking on B. Now it got updated to B. Now if we open it again and click on go, now if we click on C, it will update it to C. But here we can see that it is not multiple selector. That means on clicking any one of the item, directly it will get navigated to main screen by updating that particular single value. So now I will convert this one into multiple value selection. So how, how can we do that? Now I am going to custom search help, obvious search help. This is the class I have created for that. In this already existing code is there which is for selecting single value. That means here whatever uh, structure the selection will, will be coming into this. That selection will be in a field symbol which is having structure data. Remember guys this is structure data but in our case when we are clicking on multiple values we will get table data. That is the difference. That's why we have to make changes in this particular code in handle phase 3 and to enable the multiple selection we have to make changes in phase 0 that is configuration. So let's go to con configuration first. I am going to change mode and just I am making this table multi select as ABAP true that is x value. So we can make it as ABAP true as well that is also fine both are same. Activating this now let's observe in the UI what, uh, what has been updated. So let's see on clicking new organization we can see search terms is there on clicking this one and on clicking on go we got three values now after clicking on one value it is not going to main screen it is also allowing us to select other two fields or any one field now after clicking on ok then only it will get navigated to main screen. So that is the difference. This is multi value selection. So we can select any number of fields here. Now I am selecting C and A. Now I see what happens. It doesn't even work now. Now I am clicking on OK. Let's see why it is working first. So I am keeping a breakpoint here to check why it is not working. Now I am checking any two values and clicking on OK. Now breakpoint got triggered. Now in this selection we are having a table data. So this is expected. But here LS selection is there. This, this one will be now in table. It is in table. So what is happening because of this old encode SN component short form of structure. 
now let's go to this half structure to field symbol so this is actually not the structure now this is the table so what happens it doesn't even get assigned so short form is not at all getting assigned that is the reason it is becoming empty that's it now we have to make code changes here and assuming that this is coming as a table so this field symbol is a table not a field anymore not a structure or field this is a table so accordingly let's change this coding i am just removing this and commenting now because we are getting the table format lt selection now we cannot loop into this one because system doesn't know in com compilation time that this is coming as a table that is why we have to make this field symbol as any table type like this so field symbols lt selection type any table now we are telling the system that this is field symbol is coming as a table type any table so that is why it is existing now now let's loop into this loop at lt selection so we have to loop into this selection assigning field symbol now let's give ls selection now this is a field symbol i am giving and end loop so now now we are navigating into one by one into this table now i am copying this assign component from here and pasting here so assign component into this ls selection so it will come here short form of structure of two field symbol now short form will come here now i have to update touch term so i will explain this in a notepad now we have to write some logic to make it work now here if we are checking on a b and c for example system should show us a comma b comma c so it should be separated by commas now we have to write the code in this way so if it comes a b and c in a table a b and c in an internal table are in repeated format now we have to make it into this type of format by using this abap conditions now let's start that so we are having short form into structure and here we are getting lv short form so lv short form what will be there initially so if we are clicking on a a will come if we are clicking on b b will come if we click a and b first a will come in first iteration next b will come in same way we have to write a code such that if it is only one suppose if a a is there it should not come as a comma that is why only a should come for that we have to write a logic if only one one is there so in this if say tab x tab x means iteration count if this iteration count is 1 then then lv set stem is there so then lv set stem equal to lv short form so first time 
it should directly assign that one now i am keeping else condition else else and let's close end if also so when it is iterating for first time only a will get populated in the search term if it iter if it iterates second time so if we click on any two values second time also it will come at that time in between one comma should be there as a separator so i am using concatenate option now concatenate lv search term that means previously whatever it is filled in the previous iteration that one will come that means a or b in this case a so a will come after that a comma should be there so i am adding a comma here in a string format and then next what should be there next lv short form so the new one into lv search term that's it i think you got the logic now for example our logic is for example we have selected a and b in a table so first a will come so a will get populated in this search term lv search term next what happens is s site abix will not be equal to 1 it will come as 2 in second iteration then so at that time it will go to concatenation in this in this place now a will come and concatenates with comma and then again concatenates with lv short form that means the new one b like that a comma b will come in the ui that means we are it is ready to work now let's check in the ui how it is going to show in the ui for safety i am just adding i lv short form is assigned now end if that's it pretty printer now let's activate and check it close it close the ui new organization so it is loaded now we can see search terms it is having f4 help now on clicking that we are getting go button after clicking this go we are having three options for example i am clicking on c and a and click on okay now let's see what is happening selection is coming now in this selection we will have table data now it is going to loop one by one now observe this search term initially so this is the one which we are giving at finally at set, set attribute so in the ui this one will be shown so focus on this search term now first time site abix is equal to 1 we can see because it is first iteration now after this one search term got updated with c value because we have clicked the first one as c next what happens in second loop again it will come short form it will get assigned now short form is assigned again now we can see if psi tab x equal to 1 but in our case this is 2 that is why it is it will go into else case now it will go into concatenate now this logic will get applied set term which is there already c comma new one i wish short form this is new one a so c comma a will get populated into lv search term so after this we can see in search term c comma a now it will come out of loop because it, the, it is having only two rows second it will come out now now this will get setted in the ui now 
click on continue we can see c comma a is populated in the ui that's it it is working as expected that's it guys for today's video thank you